Okay, folks, I want to talk to you about, I want you to look at the insulation right here. Okay, see how bad this is? Now, here's what I've done is I've actually just taken out all the insulation here. This is nothing but a bare can. What I'm going to do, this, this unit got totally saturated, had a coil panel leak. The, the insulation was drenched and wet, so she lost the integrity of the insulation. So what I've done here, preparation is the key to re-insulate an air handler. So I, so I vacuumed it all out. I'm actually going to vacuum it a little bit more just to show you what I'm talking about. I just take my regular shop vac. Okay, so the bottom line is we have to have a nice, dry, clean area. Because what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this arm flex, and I'm just going to show this to you. Here's a full sheet of it. This arm flex comes in three quarter inch or half inch. It's usually three by five sheets. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to measure what I need here. Measure it all out, length, width. I'm going to get some spray glue. All you technicians and all you service guys know how to use the spray glue. Then we're going to take it and we're going to cut it to fit right up in here. We're just going to make a whole new sleeve here. Okay? I'll show you how that works in just a moment when I get this finished. So basically, we're going to put this new Armaflux inside. And actually, the R value of the housing will be much better than it was from the factory. Plus, if it gets wet, it won't saturate the insulation. I'll get back with you in just a moment.